And we're rolling. All right, so I'm here with Etta, our pixel on Ragdolls for Zombie U. Uh, we played the game recently and wanted to ask a few quick questions about the title. Uh, so first of all, uh, for people who haven't been following it, try to explain like the core concept of Zombie U as far as, I mean, we know it's a zombie game, we know it's a first picture, but what makes it special from other zombie games? Right, so it is true survival form. It's built from the ground up for the Wii U, and this is the first time that we're actually seeing a first-person shooter survival horror game built with a two-screen concept, so it allows us to do a lot of really unique things with the gameplay. Um, for instance, a lot of your HUD is actually on the gamepad itself, and uh, you can actually use different devices. So we have a new scanner feature, and we really reward you for using it and just exploring your environment, picking up all of the ammo, because you will not A lot of people really have it, like been clamoring for the return to classic survival horror, like you know, like Resident Evil and even Silent Hills. It kind of got in a little bit more of an action bent now. With the, but Zombie U is is truly dependent on thinking and, and you know, low ammo and, and doing things smartly and slowly. Um, you know, would you? Compare it to say it's a little bit like a first-person Dark Souls in a way. Like it's kind it's of in that simple. brutal, unforgiving, be yes, slow, be I will smart. I say it is really difficult. Actually, the uh, demo that we're showing here at PAX uh, is extremely difficult. Only six people have managed to get through the entire thing, um, just because a lot of people are very used to running and gunning and not really exploring, and they end up failing in the end. Uh, however, there is a really unique death mechanic in the game, so you can. Actually Thank you so much. Thank you. 